Hi, my name is Jay Kramer, an application engineer as part of our DME team here at ANSYS. Uh, in this video, I'm going to be highlighting for you some improvements we've made in Aviator to support launch to um, LEO or low earth orbit operations in SDK 12.9 or 2024 R2. Uh, an important piece with putting any satellite into orbit is actually getting up there to space. Uh, Aviator can be a key solution for this, uh, helping you model realistic launch and orbit entry uh, procedures. So SDK 12.9 uh, looks to expand on these capabilities through a few enhancements. Uh, the first of which is that the physics and gravity model used by Aviator has been upgraded to enhance fidelity across the entire flight envelope um, to the LEO uh, orbit environment uh, with refinement and calculations at the border between orbital and suborbital flight. We've also increased the maximum allowed speed in Aviator from seven kilometers per second to eight kilometers per second to better capture those LEO operation speeds. Um, lastly, various limitations that were originally imposed have been removed uh, with the effect that wide variety of basic maneuver strategies that uh, make sense in orbital flight situations now work in orbit. So for instance, you can now take off from runways and launch pads and use the available aerodynamics and thrust models to fly into orbit. And then once there, uh, maneuver around in the same manner as um, a space shuttle would. Um, the higher fidelity of math and physics will likely have a subtle effect um, on low and slow air vehicles as well, uh, pertaining uh, particularly pertaining to, to lift required, which of course will affect values like angle of attack, drag, thrust, bank angles, uh, etc. Uh, once at altitude and in orbit, um, which can be determined by the circular orbit ECF speed to go data provider with an aviator, uh, which is used to tell how much more speed you need in, in order to make it into orbit, um, you can then export, export that uh, ephemeris of that aviator trajectory and use that as a input in the initial state tool for your desired uh, satellite propagator to propagate forward with a better orbit um, and, and, and gravity model, um, such as you know SGP4 or, or, or something like HPOP. Um, for more information on using Aviator to model or better support your legal operations, feel free to reach out to us at support at AGI.com. Uh, for all things new in SDK and Aviator 12.9, uh, be sure to check out the SDK help. Thanks.